internet and welcome or welcome back to another video my name is Clarice if you're new here and today's video is going to be kind of a reset vlog but also it's gonna be pretty chill um, today is Thursday and I really need to honestly deep clean the house today so I'm gonna put my sheets in the wash and then get ready for the day and we can go ahead and do some cleaning without further ado i hope that you enjoy make sure to subscribe and let's get right into it hi guys so i am currently in my kitchen and i'm gonna start by cleaning out this area because it is honestly so incredibly messy it's kind of bothering me i want to do this as a part of like this reset and i think it'll be really helpful because i'm starting university next week so i want to make sure i have a clean environment you know i take care of myself i do some hobbies you know i just like recharge before classes start because i know that's going to be really draining and i'm probably not going to have the energy to clean and like do all that much besides school at that time it's already 3 p.m and the sun is going to start setting anytime soon so i want to get started before that happens because I know as soon as the sun starts to set I just kind of like get a little bit sleepy, you know, I'm gonna have this energy drink. It's by I actually don't know how to pronounce this so I'll just show you guys the label. This is actually made out of tea It's like a tea energy infusion and it's in the ginger flavor. So that should be interesting Hope you enjoy this cleaning montage Mm -hmm. That's interesting. I think I like it. It's very sparkly. Not sparkly, bubbly, fizzy. You know what I mean. Hello everyone, it is currently almost lunchtime and so I'm gonna make some food and get back to my productive day in a minute. But first I wanted to say a quick word from today's sponsor, Beekeepers Naturals. So part of my reset routine is also making sure that I'm doing my best to take care of myself and really feel good, which includes looking after my health. And that's where Beekeepers Naturals comes in. I've been using their Propolis Throat Spray daily, which helps proactively support the immune system and can also help you soothe a dry throat or dry cough if you're feeling under the weather, especially in the winter time. And as I'm going to be starting classes again next week, there are a lot of colds going around. So I need to make sure that I'm looking after my immune system. I actually have another one of these that I'm going to be putting it in my backpack and bringing with me to school. The key ingredient in this is propolis, which has so many benefits that help with that, seeing as it's rich in antioxidants, vitamin C, iron, zinc, B vitamins, and over 300 other beneficial compounds. Thank you so much to Beekeepers Naturals for partnering with me on this video, and make sure to go check them out in the link in my description to get your own propolis throat spray and stay protected this flu season. 
Okay, right now I'm gonna make myself some food really quickly and then I have a lot of work to do today in terms of like replying to emails and doing some editing. I'm actually meeting up with my friend Krista this afternoon and we're gonna go to a coffee shop and both do some editing to just like hold each other accountable. So I think that's gonna be nice. And yeah, yesterday was like the cleaning day. Today is like grind mode activated. Like I have to get work done. Sunday and I'm gonna be finishing this reset today. I have a lot planned, but yeah, uh, last time I vlogged was actually on Friday and as you guys saw, I went to the coffee shop. I had a really productive time there. My friend Krista only ended up being able to meet me like later on in the day. So I kind of just did some editing and honestly, it was really a vibe. And then we met up and we caught up. We had some Pokeballs and we went to see anyone but you. I think I like just needed to see what the hype was about because I've been seeing so many posts about it on Instagram. And I was like, people are saying like rom-coms are back. And as a lover of rom-coms, I have to go see if that's true. And honestly, it was a fun time. Like I wouldn't say it's as good as like 90s rom-coms. Um, but it was just like funny and especially seeing it in theaters like everyone was reacting to it And I think that just made the experience so much more fun and I obviously had a really good time like discussing it with Krista afterwards and It was a nice little evening honestly um, And then yesterday I didn't vlog because I just had kind of like a bit of a boring day It was kind of disappointing <laughs> honestly. I just did some editing all day I went to the library to try to be more productive and then I was supposed to go see My Fair Lady with my friend Melina but something came up and she couldn't go but by the time I learned that I was already on the way so I just went to see it alone which is honestly fine by me like I'm trying to do more things alone anyways but it was just like a little bit harder to enjoy it on my own knowing that I still had so much editing to do so and yeah I was kind of procrastinating editing too so I only finished it at like 2 a.m. which is not too bad because I like got to sleep in a little bit this morning but yeah it just contributed to feeling a little bit stressed but I'm trying to let that go and just like kind of focus on today I'm making myself a matcha right now because I'm gonna need the energy I'm gonna be doing some meal prepping because I'm starting classes again tomorrow actually which is kind of weird to think about. I feel like I'm not gonna realize that school has started again until I'm like in class. Um, so anyways, regardless of that, I'm gonna just meal prep a little bit. I wanna make some of these matcha cookies that I've made before in the past and I just like bringing them to school cause I mean, I'm literally making myself a matcha. So clearly I like it. Oh, besides that, I also need to do my weekly journaling, which I've been trying to get back into and I just like ask a few different prompts to myself so i'm gonna do that plan my week do my meal prepping and then my friend charlotte is coming over and i think we're just gonna hang out i don't know we'll see what what i get up to
have been asking me to talk a little bit about how I journal and I actually made a video quite a while ago kind of explaining how I got into journaling, how I use it, and sort of the different ways in which I journal. Um, but just to walk you through my prompts this week, so I have this week's intentions, which is just like how I want to feel, what my like priority is, say if I want to feel focused or if I want to be more grateful or whatever. Um, then I list three goals I want to achieve, something I'm looking forward to, something I will do for myself, and then what am I most grateful for this week. And these are just like the prompts I'm using today. Sometimes I like to switch these up. I look at a lot of inspiration on Pinterest and I would really recommend doing that. Just type up like weekly journal prompts and then you'll find a bunch or journal prompts for a new semester or whatever it is that you're journaling for. And I do like to also do like stream of consciousness, which is where I just like write whatever's on my mind and I kind of rant. So I kind of switch between those two methods, but I found that Recently, prompts have been working really well for me because they're kind of lower effort or they don't feel like as daunting because sometimes at the end of the day, I'm like not super awake to be like writing my entire day out. Whereas answering prompts is pretty straightforward and it's still a good way to like kind of track how you're feeling and check in with yourself. So I'm gonna fill this out right now and then we can move on to planning my week. But I hope that this was helpful if you're just wondering like how exactly I journal. Oh, by the way, if you wanna know which, I just whoop myself in the face with these. If you wanna know which journal I use, this is um, from the brand Lichtum 1917. I don't know if that's how you pronounce it, but I do have a promo code if you're based in Canada. So I'll li link it up down below. Good evening everyone, I am currently getting ready for bed because I feel like this reset routine wouldn't be complete without a relaxing night routine. This afternoon my friend Charlotte came over and we just 
did some baking which was super fun we made some matcha cookies and then also some like cinnamon roll sugar cookies so i'm not gonna be running out of cookies anytime soon and since then i've just had dinner i took a shower and i've been doing some editing but now it's time to get ready for bed because i do have university classes tomorrow which i don't want to go to but whatever besides that i've also literally prepared everything i can for tomorrow i literally have my outfit laid out i also planned down my lunch like i cut up some celery which now that i'm thinking about it might not have been the wisest snack choice because i'm just going to be crunching away in the corner of the classroom but whatever <laughs> Oh my god, <laughs> my back just cracked so loudly. 